Welcome to the countdown timer and dynamic bid form video. The first thing we're going to show here is actually the extended bidding time. So a bid is going to come in now and it will be placed under the 30 second time frame. So for this example, extended bidding is set to 30 seconds. Any bid that comes in under that time frame will reset the countdown to 30 seconds for subsequent bids. So Dom Delio is a high bidder at 61. Sample bidder just came in and took over the high bid at 63. And then Dom Delio actually bid again, but since he bid 65, the bid went to 67 for sample bidder. So sample bidder obviously has a proxy or limit bid in the system. So the fifth bid that's coming in now for Dom Delio is at 72, and he overtook the high bid that was 70 for sample bidder. So you get to see how proxy bidding works there. One last bid will come in. We don't know that Dom Delio has another limit bid or proxy bid behind the scenes here. So another bid takes place and pushes his final bid up to 75. So this video shows a few different things. Number one, it shows how the extended bidding process works and how the countdown clock gets reset when a bid is placed during the extended bidding time frame. It also shows how the dynamic bid form works and how the updated data flashes green and then returns to its regular color and it shows that the extended bidding time is shown in red. And now the last part, our auction closes and that's it. Thanks for watching our video. To stay in touch, please follow us on Twitter at AuctionAnything or like us on Facebook.